WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here, the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, the author of the opening call daily newsletter. I'm looking at the at noon today. The Dow is up 59 points at 29,161. It pulled all the way back to the nine period exponential moving average, which has been positive for the past four sessions. Most importantly, it had a really nice rally. It ran all the way to 29,223. Yes, it's given back quite a bit, but the fact that it rallied was a good sign. Yes, it was uh, influenced by Boeing, but so far, this is good action. I've got a really conflict. I'll be talking about it in my show coming up in a few minutes, the Tiger Technicians Hour. Uh, this is a little bit of a conflict for me because even though it was a very small all-time high on Friday, on Thursday, both in the Dow and the S&P, and the S&P is up right now at 11 at 338, uh, there is a, a pattern that I talk about which is called in the Chapman Wave methodology. It's called the dark cloud news cover. I'll be having a webinar on it this coming Thursday. And basically it says if there's really bad news, how the market responds to it and how short a time frame is really important. Certainly we've got the bad news, but the market seems to be responding quite well. Uh, the QQQ at this moment is also up. It's at an all-time high at 230.73, up $1.53. The IWM, as always, lagging in the Russell 2000, not a good move, up 29 cents at 165. Just kind of stuck at some point. I will not be surprised if sometime, maybe in the spring or the summer, the, the small caps actually start to find buyers at this particular point. Fund managers are going for the Amazons. They're going for what's working. Amazon all-time high at 2,120, up 40. I think that's where they're going. Look at gold. <clears throat> gold is up a little bit. It's up 4.6 at 1578, stuck in this range. But I've been saying that it's holding well. I just don't see anything to make it a major buy right now. I don't actually see it to be a major sell either. It's just stuck. Look at the dollar. The dollar's been going to recovery high. Whoa, another big move up 19 ticks and 98.87, getting closer and closer to the 99.67 um, most recent high. If you look at the right side chart, you'll see that back back in let me kind of there it is. back in January of 2017, it was at 103.82. To February of 2018 at 88.25. This is a very nice comeback, just over half the way back. I'll be back and we'll talk about crude oil, we'll talk about bonds in my Tiger Technicians Hour. I hope you can stay. Otherwise, see you tomorrow. Have a great day.